you guys are looking to buy FIFA coins with fast delivery and cheap prices or open up FIFA packs on a brand new website for real coin totals, check out FIFACoinZone.com and use the code HABER to get yourself 5% off. Or if gift cards and game keys are more your thing, check out Aniba.com, link in the description. You can get one euro for signing up using my link. Definitely check them out. They sell gift cards and FIFA point codes for cheaper than their market price. Like I said, link in the description. EA, what are you doing? What on earth are you doing, EA? What are you doing? What? I'm a little bit confused at the minute. I mean, we've just got, we've just had three very nice kits as well. Thank you very much. Um, something very unlike EA, they've released very good content that isn't pack based. They've released upgrade packs. Foot Champions Premium Upgrade Packs. This is, seems like the best thing I've ever seen from EA. And uh, and, and just want to show you guys real quick. Uh, out of, you know, all the elite finishes I've had this year. Out of all the gold finishes I've had this year. I have a grand total of three red cards in my club. And I don't know where the rest have gone. I evidently have submitted them into SBCs and I don't remember it. And I feel like an idiot now because this is like the best. I've seen people getting amazing packs in them and I'm getting nothing. I have a red controller for goodness sake. Where are EA? Uh, but what they've done is they've released six brand new Prime Icons or Prime Icon Moment SBCs, should I say. We've got Cruyff, Laudrup, Hernandez, Roberto Carlos, Bobby Moore. And the last one is Rivaldo. So we've got all six of those. I am only interested in Roberto Carlos because he is absolutely unreal looking in my opinion. Um, and I think that it helps me on my quest to eventually having a full icon team, which is what I want to do eventually. <laughs> stupid as that sounds. That just sounds so stupid, but I want to have a full and tradable icon team. It just, I don't think it's ever going to be possible because, you know, I don't have Prime Zanetti and not uh, Optimus Prime Zanetti is a CDM, so that's going to suck. Uh, so I might just have to have a Prime Prime Icon Moments team and then Dumfries. Um, but I'm going to complete uh, Roberto Carlos, despite having packed myself a red um, a red Robertson. Uh, the reason I'm going to complete that uh, Icon Carlos is because Robertson isn't great. He's not great. He hasn't got enough jumping and strength for me uh, to enjoy him, sadly. Um... I need some, by the way, I need some informs or walkouts from these packs. Yeah, please give me something. Um, oh, Robin's good. 85 rate. We'll take that. So I, I'm going to complete this Roberto Carlos because I think it'd be a lot better as a left back. Um, and we do have an 87 rated red uh, card to submit into him. I've not even played champs yet this weekend. So we're going to play some champs. I want to open up. I want to open up at least one of those premium red upgrades, um, but I obviously don't have the reds. So I've uh, been asking around a few people that I open packs for, and hopefully we'll get one for you for tomorrow, uh, for tomorrow's video, because um, that'll be dope, because I actually just think they look really cool, and I'm really interested in it, but uh, but we'll have to see about that. Uh, regardless, though, I am very interested in this Roberto Carlos card. I will show you guys the stats of him and why I'm interested in him in, in just a second. But we're about to get no walkouts at all and one board. We've had one board from how many? 35k packs EA? You know, these pay out icons if you get them from Div 1 Rivals. They don't pay out nothing if you open them with FIFA points EA. What is this? What is this? We've opened up five so far. This will be the sixth. We've had one board. What? What? Two boards. Okay, two boards and six is ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous. At least be Diego Costa. Yes, another 85 rated. All right, that's decent. We'll take an 85. That's not too bad. Uh, I'm going to get cracking on this Roberto Carlos SBC, though, because he is in my best interest to complete, you know, and, and to complete quickly as well so I can use him in champs. Team number one has been completed. It's the 87 rated squad. Now, this is actually quite expensive. It's like 260k. I've done it for like 240, given that uh, Lukaku and Otamendi uh, are both untradeable and Ben Mee was pack pulled. Uh, obviously, Ben Mee does have a value, but I'm just going to submit him anyway because he's tradable, but might as well. I might just uh, get rid of my Costa and my Robben. Um, I think I probably could have done it for a little bit cheaper as well, but I'm just going to submit this anyway. I have no use for this Lukaku card. Um, literally none at all. I've tried it several times. I say several times. I tried it twice and I hated it both times. So I'm just going to submit it. Uh, maybe one day he is going to be incredibly useful for me and I'm going to regret submitting him. But we're going to do it anyway. Uh, and then we're going to go ahead and, and do the rest of them. Now, I'm probably going to struggle a little bit, to be honest. I'm on four, uh, 353k. Uh, I might have to open up some more promo packs. Um, so, unless we get some incredible luck, I think that's what's going to have to happen. Is I'm going to have to open up a couple of promo packs. Because I don't think I'm going to be able to afford to do this without a little bit of luck. 
Uh, but 85s are always brilliant as well. And I've got, I've still got uh, one or two SBC cards that are fairly high rated that I don't mind submitting. So um, we're going to go ahead and do those. And we're seven minutes away from objectives. So who knows, there might be like a weekly objective. And that's also very good, having a draft token. There might be a weekly objective that might be useful as well. So uh, that draft token is very nice. So we can go ahead and do a draft and get some packs from that. So we've got the, in my opinion, the more expensive teams now to go. Uh, sorry, not the more expensive teams. The more um, time-consuming teams now. The ones with the informs are always a bit annoying. But uh, I don't think it's going to be that much from here on out. Now, if I'm looking at the minute, um, the 86 squad looks to be about 180-ish K or 170K. Uh, the 85 squad's about 140. So that takes me up to my budget. And then I've got the 84, the 83, and the easy ones. So... Probably going to need an extra 150-ish K, so I might have to open up some packs, but we'll see down the line. I'm going to go ahead and, com and complete the 86 squad now. I just wish they didn't nerf the packs a bit. Like, that should really be, in my opinion, a 100K pack, a rare mega pack, and a rare player pack, but... We'll see. Anyway, let's go ahead and over, uh, do the rest of the teams. The 86 raid squad has been completed. Now, I know you're all saying, first of all, Ryan, don't you dare submit that M raid Chan. I don't use it. The only time I've actually used it is for that uh, requirement. You know, the Serie A one, the weekly objective. Have no, I have no use for that card. We'll never use it. This Robertson is going to be replaced with Roberto Carlos regardless. So I am going to be submitting it. Uh, I just want to double check something to make sure I'm actually doing the Roberto Carlos. Yeah, okay. So before I've actually submitted a, an icon into 100k pack and it wasn't the right one. Just wanted to double check. So yeah, the, uh, the Robertson's getting replaced with Roberto Carlos anyway. So it doesn't matter about submitting him. Uh, I'm not going to feel bad about it at all. Uh, I do want to make something really clear because a lot of people get really upset. I see comments like, wow, if I could have like a fifth of his club, I'd be happy. I spend a lot of money on the game. If there was any kind of way EA implemented, like, trade offers or anything, I want to make this promise to you right now. I would give away a lot of players. I would give people players that I don't use, high-rated icons that I don't use, players that don't even make my bench, players like Emray Channel, players like Robertson. I don't need them. And that's why they go into SBCs, and truthfully, I would give away the players. But EA don't provide anything like that. So I, I just don't. You know, I just use them in SBCs. Uh, a lot of people get upset, but if they make it cheaper for me, that's worth it for me. So I just wanted to say that, get that off my chest for all, a lot of people that, you know, get upset when they see me submit high-rated plays they wish you could use. Because, honestly, I wish you could use them too, truthfully. I really do. So, we've got a 50k pack. Probably not going to get anything from it. I'm not expecting anything from it. Again, no walkout, as expected. Um... We have got an inform though. That's good. That is actually really good. Okay, it's going to be Spanish cam. It's going to be Pozuelo, I'm guessing. Is it Pozuelo? Yeah, Pozuelo. All right, we'll take that. 82 raid inform's great. That saves me, I want to say like 19k, 18k, something like that. So that's fantastic. Um, we've also got an 84 in there and a couple of 83s. So it's not too bad. Although I feel like the icon packs are always rigged to get absolutely nothing from them. So we're probably not going to get any walkouts from any packs. But let's go ahead and complete some more teams. Okay, so the good news we've got is we have got three 86 plus foot champions picks to open. Now, I know I was doing the Roberto Carlos SBC, but Sam messaged me and he was like, hey, I've got three to open. Will you open them and send me a picture of who I get so I can choose who to get? And I was like, yes, yes, and more yes. So this video has been all over the place. I don't even know if we're going to complete the Roberto Carlos in this video or not, but let's open up three 86 overall foot champions packs. All right, first one. Now, I've seen... Bates and open these. I've seen the ped there's uh hinting about open these. I've seen a lot of people very excited about these. Bates and got like 92 modric is his best player. There's a lot of really good informs, you know. Hopefully, we can get one really good. Uh, to give you an idea of what Sam's team looks like, let me quickly show you guys what it looks like. This is what Sam's team currently looks like. So to benefit him, we want someone like Oh, I don't even know, to be honest. We want just some good players, really. We just want some good players. So let's go ahead and open it and see what we can get. So first one. Here we go. Come on. Oh, that's a good start. 90 Di Maria is a very, very good start. Of course, Sam wants to know who to pick. So I'll send him uh, a message now saying who the players are and, uh, and he can pick from them. I'm guessing it's going to be Di Maria, though. I can only guess Sam wants a Knight Di Maria, and it has a value on the market currently. The Inform version does of about 230k, and looks like a really solid card. Obviously, he's got five-star skills. His weak foot lets him down a whole lot, unfortunately, but he's got 85 jumping, 86 stamina, 
Uh, 70 strength, 86 aggression. In my opinion, looks like a, I don't know, like a cheaper version of maybe like a Rivaldo or something like that. You know, he's he's 5'11". It's not exactly short. He's got decent jumping and stamina, uh, decent shooting, uh, decent, uh, you know, dribbling and uh, five-star skills. Obviously, Rivaldo only has four-star skills. But it looks pretty decent in my opinion and uh, and probably like a cheaper version. So uh, Sam just messaged me back and said pick Di Maria. So if pick Di Maria, let's go for the next one now. Imagine, imagine, right? Just imagine if champs rewards were like this. Imagine if champs rewards, like for, for top 100, you got 386 plus overalls. Or like for, for a leaky, you got like one or something. That would be so much better in my opinion. But the second one, come on. Ouch. Uh, okay, not not a good one. Not a good one. Not a good one. Oh gosh. Oh no. Okay, that's not good. That one. That one isn't great. They. These ones happen though. These ones happen. Samuel wants Devry from this, so we'll pick Devry. Come on, EA. Let's redeem it with the third one, please. Gods of EA, of pack gods, anything, whoever it is that blesses the packs, please. I'm not gonna look. I'm not looking. It's open. I'm not looking. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna try and block them off and go like left to right. Here we go. All right. First one's Dembele. I can see that. Second one's 86, it's Ruffier. Oh god, please say the third one's high rated. Third one. Oh, it's 88 Donnarumma. Ah, it's not good. It's not good. I mean, it's not bad. It's not bad, but it's not good. Oh, no. I was honestly really hoping we get a huge, huge card. Oh, it's unfortunate. But you know what? This is a decent looking card, to be fair. This is a decent looking card. Shamey's not got great stamina. This is also not a bad looking card. This card looks all right. Not great. I think he's probably going to want Donnarumma. Uh, let's go ahead and show him. So these are the three ones. That's that's unfortunate. Sam actually got De Gea just before this, which is what made him do three of them. Uh, he, he did one and got De Gea. So uh, it's kind of rough. But but you know what? A 90 rated card is pretty decent if you ask me. It's still like a 200k plus card. Uh, massive thank you to Sam for letting me open them. If you have enjoyed the video, leave a like down below. Subscribe to the channel if you guys are new around here. Uh, this video has been a weird concoction of, of different things. So let me know if you enjoyed it down below. Thank you for watching and I'll see you later.